Michael Cohen gave a blockbuster performance during his testimony before the House Oversight Committee today, during which he alleged that Trump has committed a bevy of criminal acts and is in fact a racist and conman, the two words which many Americans would agree best describe our current president. Throughout the hearing, Republicans attacked and mocked Cohen in an effort to discredit him and protect the leader of their party. At no point did they make even a superficial effort to ask Cohen incisive questions about what he knows of Trump, his crimes, or his character. As such, the Republican members of the committee ended up looking like complete partisan hacks, and it was abundantly clear to anyone of good sense watching that the GOP has no interest in getting to the truth if it means sacrificing power. Trump's national emergency declaration is an unprecedented abuse of presidential power. Add your name to tell Congress to put a stop to his bogus power grab immediately. After slogging through an entire day of Republican antagonization and insightful Democratic questions, Cohen concluded his testimony with perhaps his most disturbing comments to date. After reflecting on the fact that working in the service of Trump has destroyed his life, ruined his career, and hurt his family, Cohen dove into ominous prognostication 